Your PG&E bill is going up again. That's twice since the start of 2024. Fox 26 reporter Rich Rodriguez kicks off our team coverage tonight, explaining the reason behind the rate hike. PG&E customers started the new year with a $38 rate hike. Last week, PG&E went back to the California Public Utilities Commission and got the okay to raise rates another $5. That's a $43 increase in less than three months. What's behind the hikes? The executive director of TURN, the Utility Reform Network, says PG&E exceeded its budget on wildfire safety. So they have a $9 billion overspend that they keep coming back to ratepayers and saying, we need you to pay for this piece of it. We need you to pay for that piece of it. Catholic Charities Fresno is seeing a big demand from people it assists to help pay their utility bills. It spiked up in the beginning of the year, so we can imagine now that when it, the second jump goes up, because those first batch of people were concerned, like why, when and why is it going to happen again? So how is PG&E allowed to overspend on wildfire mitigation? Mark Tony says in 2019, the state legislature passed AB 1054 that created a wildfire insurance fund. He says if a utility has a cost overrun, it can go back to the PUC and ask for recovery from ratepayers. They have a credit card with no limits and a guarantee that the ratepayers are going to pay for it. That is the cause of the overspending. No limits. Catholic Charities says the line for PG&E bill assistance keeps getting longer. The goal is to run out of money to invest this money in the proper way we can. You know, so do I anticipate right now? Yes, we're going to. The new rate goes into effect in April. Mark Tony says ratepayers need to complain to their state lawmakers and Governor Newsom. Rich Rodriguez, Fox 26 News. Oh, it is worth noting that earlier today we reached out to PG&E, but we are still waiting for a response.